This project is an honest and in-depth perspective of and from former students of Milton Hershey School. We call ourselves MILTS. An organic, open discussion of life before, during, and after attending MHS. So welcome back, party people. <laughs> hey, yo. What's up, Milt Talk Podcast family? What's going on, man? Don't, don't mind us. We feel it enough. Um, we just wanted to have a little thing where we got back and came and talked to you to let you know where we've been and, and where things are and where we're trying to go. So, you know, this is just a little bit of an update. We hope this, uh, this message reaches you healthy and happy with the pandemic and the holidays and everything. So, you know, um, I'm going to let my sister Jess start off and then I'll jump in and we'll kind of go from there. So we just kind of wanted to go over a couple things, keep everyone updated on, you know, what we're doing. I know we haven't um, dropped any episodes recently, but we just want to let you guys know we're still in it. We're still doing it. Um, we have a lot of great episodes up and coming, but I want to talk about like all the hard work that we put in in the past, you know, to make this happen, you know, especially over COVID, arranging times, doing interviews and, you know, First and foremost, everyone who, you know, helped keep it alive with donating and listening and really promoting us. I mean, you know, it was very humbling to see all that love and support from everybody. Um, we, you know, we greatly appreciate everything that everyone has done, you know, to keep us up and running. So we just want to get that out there and say we thank you a lot for that, because that means a lot Absolutely. from everybody. Absolutely. <laughs> um, I'm just going to piggyback on what Jess was saying, you know, about our appreciation of, of the support and everything. And, Sorry. You no, know, we had uh, the episodes that we have put out so far have been received well and everybody's been super supportive. Um, you know, we kind of wanted to talk about where we've been, obviously, with, uh, with COVID and, and, and a couple of us have moved. Some of us have gotten married. Obviously, there was the, uh, you know, the protests for equal rights, Black Lives Matter. Um, the holidays are upon us. We all have kids that went back to school. So, you know, there was a, a, a lot of factors that um, kind of held us up as far as being able to get you the next episode. Um, and that's why we're checking in with you just to kind of give you an update on what's been going on. And, uh, you know, more importantly, to let you know, we have quite a few more episodes coming up. Um, and our goal is to get the next one to you prior to Christmas. And hopefully we'll be able to piggyback and start getting our momentum back again and, and start get these out to you. Um, and, uh, you know, really, that's what this is about. <clears throat> I'm going to um, let Warner tell you about what we got coming up. And then the go he's going to speak to you as well. Um, but again, just thank you for all your support so far. And, and please keep writing us on Facebook and reaching out, you know, things that you might want to hear or people you might want to see, and we'll do the best we can. Or questions that you might want us to ask that you don't hear us ask. Definitely. When we're doing those. Yeah, we do, uh, just to piggyback off of what they both said, um, what Jess and both, uh, both said is, well, first off, thank you. And it was very humbling to see the support from the whole Milk Talk podcast fan, like that's that's love, like from the door. That's first off. Uh, second, yes, we want to keep you updated on what's going on and what's uh, what we have in store. Um, we have some shout outs we want to um, give out to people, and I'm going to. It's a it's a long list, but I, I ask you to uh, bear with me because each and every name is very uh, important to the Milk Talk podcast family, and they help to support us. So I'm definitely want to shout them all out. So here we go. <clears throat> we'll start off with uh, Frederica Lawrence, Freddie, as I know her, uh, my sis, uh, Mariah Harkins, uh, Felicia Tuttle, uh, Robin Williams, Morgan Henderson. <laughs> I don't know what's so funny. <laughs> Somebody uh, walked like, by and was trying to Because people just face. don't know how to not laugh because <laughs> we're still silly. <laughs> Like for real, I'm sorry. you know, keep it, keep it 100. She <laughs> looked like she was under witness protection, though. <laughs> what do you say? He's <laughs> like, oh no, <laughs> what did I do? Yo. I didn't know what happened. Uh, they may laugh in between, I don't know what's going on, 
I'm supposed to do the shout out, so that's what I'm doing. You're good, bro. You're good. Don't worry, they'll they'll all get restrictions <laughs> later. <laughs> oh, man. We got Claudia Hofsis. I hope I did not butcher your name. Keep moving, keep moving. Uh, Pat Pamplin, my dude. <clears throat> uh, Big Stretch, Randy Whitney. Cindy and Chuck Seidel. Thank you, guys. Classmates. Uh, Deanna Slamans. Nadine Hokayam. Uh, with the Nutri Patch. That's, That's my home. Girl. Super love right there. Absolutely. Uh, Sue Grippen. <laughs> Yes, yeah, sir. Dr. Melissa L. Fulmore, Bobby right. Carr, Cardo Kingsbury, Deb Cologne Bradley, Jack Martin, John Mueller, Sarah Corey Boyes, uh, Boys, I believe it is, Angela Shade, Andre Wright, or as I know him, Andre um, Sellers, uh, Mrs. Schilling, Miss Schilling, I'm sorry, Carol Schilling. Kyle Stromberg, Big Don Kyle. Whitman, the boy Bob Gert, our first guest. Big Bob. <clears throat> Mike Weller, Fran Big Martin, Bob. and Eileen Martin. I had to say each and every one of your names because you guys have helped us tremendously and we thank you from the bottom of our hearts for your uh, support and your contributions to the uh, Mill Talk podcast. Definitely. Yeah. Well, that was great. I really want to see how. Uh, one more time. Uh, and all, all our anonymous uh, <clears throat> as well. Those that don't want their names um, announced, I will absolutely respect your uh, wishes. But I do want to also give you all each individually and collectively a shout out from the whole Milk Talk pa uh, podcast family. And there's Thank quite you. a few of them too. <clears throat> oh, yeah, quite a few. Thank you. Thank you. I'm with the thank you on that. Yeah. V? So, so I'm on. And so I wanted to, I know it was one of the things that we probably haven't really hit is this COVID-19 madness. Um, we started the podcast early on and right in the middle of our production, COVID-19 hit. And so that really eliminated a lot of we eliminated all of our in-person interviews, which we were actually going places. We were going out physically, making contact and interviewing uh, people on, like we had the Tiny Desk, I want to shout out Tiny Desk. Um, uh, what was that, what was that, Jack, Tiny Desk? What was that Tiny, place we were? Tiny Room for Elephants. Down Tiny Room for Elephants, I'm sorry, Tiny Desk is the music yeah. joint I'm always watching. But, no, no, which is dope but, too. But <laughs> yeah, so yeah. Tiny Room for Elephants, um, anybody that supported us at that time frame to allow us to come in, we were very impromptu. We were just making things happen as we did, as they as we went on. So we're at this moment where we're we're doing everything on Zoom. We had some people, um, JB, give me the names because I, I didn't write their names down. The people that support us, help us with the editing. Mm -hmm. My main man that video videos mm -hmm. us. Um, give me those names because I don't want to mess them up. Justin and Dwayne. Have Justin. been our backbone. The both of them, you know, uh -huh. really got us right. starting real side podcast. Um, traveling to Hershey with us, you know, making sure the sound was right, all the levels were good. Um, you know, even before we even started getting a lot of the support and budget, they were doing this on on the on the eye. So for free, basically, yeah. they were doing it for free. Exactly. And you know, we can't continue to work like that. So we 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 pay these people now, and that's because of the help that we've received over time from the donations from the many people that were just named. So these are the things that happen. So if you want to see the product um, that we put out from the beginning to the end, they're like night and day because you don't get the edits of us laughing and joking and different things like that. And we can kind of stay on point. But at this stage of the game, we're running out of money. And so, you know, this is a plea this is the point where we come and we say, we still need you and we need your help. And, you know, we, we did the, um, I don't know, whatever. The crowdfunding. The GoFundMe. We did, what the was it? Yep. The crowdfunding. <laughs> yeah, we did, but it's GoFundMe. What was the other one we used? Uh, Monkey, whatever that was we used. Indiegogo. Indiegogo. Yeah. I don't know how I forgot that because I used to use that as part of my moniker back in the day, Gogo. Um, but 
we we need you and we need your support. Um, we we still have, and I think we may have at least eight to ten um, episodes left. Episodes that we've already done. However, we still need to edit them. So JB, you want to hit that real quick on just to talk on what that editing process is because I don't know it and I don't want to be BS for nobody. No, and you hit on a couple of really good points, you know, that we were going to places and recording this live and then having our people edit it on the back end. Um, and then we kind of had to pivot with with COVID and everything. And so we recorded them on Zoom, like like Goey said, and we have a back catalog of quite a few episodes that we still want to get out to you. Um, and we are still working with the funds that you guys have supplied. And, uh, you know, again, we'll hopefully get one out within a month or so, but we're getting our back up against the wall budget wise. You know, we, we don't even really like asking for money, but we need the support. You know, it seems- as I though, actually don't mind asking for money. <laughs> <laughs> and that's why we love a go. I, I don't mind. I mean, if you, need, if you need it, you know, you gotta say what you need so that we can get this thing together. We can continue to put out the, 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 the episodes at a very professional level. Um, we just don't want to give you anything. And I feel like everybody in this group is professionals coming from the milk. They stress that in the first place is doing something to the best of your ability. That's what we're doing. And that's yeah. what we, we want you to receive that. Um, so I, I want to say again, thank you for everybody that has supported us. Thank you for the people that called in and, and left recordings that we still haven't used yet, but we still plan to use them. Um, again, COVID came and just kind of knock the wind out of our sails for a lot of the different ideas that we had in the process. There's still there's still ideas that we're going to use, just not right now, but we still plan on doing certain things. DJ H. Vidal, if you're listening, listen to what I'm saying, get on board. There's some stuff we need to do. I'm talking to you. Um, not that I'm calling you out. So um, No, not at all. No, mm -mm, that wasn't called uh, out at all. Just throwing that out. Um, but yeah. I could do that. So, um, but we still, like I said, we need you. We thank you. Also, let's be conscientious though, at the same time for everybody listening to protect yourself and your families. Um, COVID-19 is the real deal. It's taking people out. So protect yourselves, go by these CDC guidelines. Um, you know, small groups, six feet distance, keep your hands clean. Watch out for these dirty bastards out here. They don't take care of themselves and stay away from them. That's all I got to say. I want to thank you all for listening. I appreciate you. God bless you. Absolutely. I, th I, think, I think we covered it all. Is there anything anybody wanted to add? No. You know, I don't think so. I, I, one little thing I want to add is, you know, just a lot of times, like a goalie was saying, we don't see the ad libs and we're all just milts. You know, we're doing this just because we love our experience at the milk. You know, so we... A lot of this is repetitive. You heard it in some of the episodes and everything, but there's enough negative energy out there. This is about big upping and showcasing our brothers and sisters. You know, we've been trying to pick people arbitrarily, you know, we talk to teachers. We're trying, we're doing the best we can to bring you that milk love. We hope you enjoy it. You know, stay safe. Watch these, listen to them. Hopefully it'll get you to next year's homecoming and we'll go big next year. All right. Thanks. Oh, show. So yeah. happy holidays, everybody. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. Peace. Right. Peace and love. Handbells. <laughs> yeah, you know Jackie was a handbell ringer, right? <laughs> Jackie, you were? <laughs> Jackie, were you really handbells? Hell no, I wouldn't know handbells. Let it go, it was working. <laughs> I was in church trying not to get caught sleeping. Like, <laughs> Yeah, I got caught. I got dishes. I got dishes at almost a lot for sleeping. So but it I came time to sing. The white gloves was kind of hot, though. You know, we used yeah. to <laughs>
<laughs> yo, I'm, I gotta go, man. <laughs> yo. Yo, love everybody.